Let's play Mr. Cool. Oh boy, that sounds great. Mr. Cool? Yeah, what do you like on Limited you... Lives? Oh. That seems like a worrisome question. Oh yeah, also unfortunately because of the crackers, they're not really telling you everything. Because yeah, just like they completely overrode the company and everything, but yeah, Mr. Cool was published by Sierra. Yeah, the good old times. Oh my god. Could you have taken worse fonts or something? But yeah, what kind of game could this be? Well, there's only one possible thing. Yeah, it's Qbert, except. It somehow looks way worse than Qbert. It's Mr. Cool, yeah. and he's just a square that, that melts bottom, into goo whenever he dies. That bottom, like, hurts. Yep. It's the fire pit of hell. The <laughs> seizure pyramid. That sounds pretty fitting. Now, why do you keep melting when you hit some of those blocks? No, that's because uh, I get I touched by the fireballs. Fireballs oh, are kind of the lethal. Fireballs. Oh, there! Oh, oh! I thought those were birds. Nah, these are fireballs. Okay. Oh. Also, this one level just randomly decides. Oh, some blocks can be activated in only one jump, and other need three. Oh, so it's like the bad stages of Qbert. Yep. Except they already start at level one. Because I don't think that anything in this level qualifies as a good level anyway, because this game is kind of unredeemable. Oh, and yeah, yeah, instead of having like, you know, creative enemies, we just have springs. So yeah, Mr. Cool! He sure is cool, <laughs> and he will rest I in can't... peace and seizure pyramid. Yeah, I can't, ugh. I can't believe they made a worse Cubert than Cubert Cubes. Yeah, just like some, I'm pretty sure the actual Qbert is much better. Hold on a bit. I'm pretty sure I must have like Qbert on the on the Commodore 64 at some place. So let's go and play the actual game. Oh, all right. Wait, Wait Qbert and two floppies? Am I reading this right? I don't know. I guess we'll figure it out. It better be good. Millstar Electronic Cubert. Okay, pretty modest title screen, but hey. Ah, there we go. That's the Cubert that we know and love. Uh, wait. Hey, ah, a okay. Little uh, ah, no! I don't know how to <laughs> play Cubert. Okay, so left yeah. goes. Ah, uh, yeah. Would you like infinite lives? Oh, I think I might. I might need them because you see, this game does not work with diagonals. Wait, he's not even swearing whenever he dies, or at least you don't hear him swear. What the hell? That's just what it always did. It just <laughs> does that. <laughs> Right, come on, another game. I cannot I cannot accept that I'm this bad at Qbert. But yeah, it's just like I uh, ah, no. Whenever you press right, you go down and left. It's just like I don't know. This game makes no sense to me. That, that was like the NES version of Qbert had that great screen where you could uh, where it would make you uh, remap all the controls to basically whatever you want. So you could have up be down and like that. Ah, okay, no, he actually swore. It just like I'm grading this game on the Qbert swearing. Uh, uh, oh, pfft. I'm really bad at this game. <laughs> so yeah, that's what good Qbert is. Well, it's not that great anyway, but hey, it's still better than Mr. Cool. Anything is better than Mr. Cool. Oh yeah, well that's that I think that was like another game that was just kind of like Qbert and in, in everything. I just need to remember what it's called. Oh yeah, it's called Juice! JUICE! Okay, I did want... I, I'm glad you clarified that it was in fact Juice. I thought you said something else. No, it's Juice! <laughs> JUICE! Uh, 
Oh my god. My Commodore 64 just took a big fart. Oh my god! Fuck you, game! What the hell? Uh. Alright! <laughs> But yeah. Uh, oh wait, wait. That's the demo. How do I start playing? Oh, all right. Hum, num, kilowatt, flash, and recharge. Your good old buddies. So yeah, that's Qbert. Except it kind of makes a little bit more sense. I still think it's a better game than Qbert in overall. Even though it looks so dumb. Uh, with that said, we don't melt off. We just kind of dissolve in the floor. It kind of looks like you have a cane. Uh, wait. What square did I miss? Oh, oh. the one on the... Yeah. Right. Oh my god, this entire game is about giving seizures! Uh, to be I fair, mean, Atari like, games did that too. Yeah, yeah but Cuba still, that doesn't that. make it okay! Back ah. then, flashing lights meant fun. Excitement! Whoa! I'm being chased by children, help! Yeah, Q Pac Man. It's Q Bird, but I guess it makes a little bit more sense. Doesn't look very good, but hey, at least the gameplay makes sense. You press right, you go right. You press up, you go up. But yeah, in order to get rid of the things, you have to teleport. Thankfully, they do not have the know how in order to deal with teleportation. Star. <gasps> No! I've been ambushed by a fucking egg! But yeah, did that sound, however, is really good. That's how dying in video games should be. But yeah, at least this game gives you some respite before throwing you already into the levels where it's just like, oh hey, you have to hit the, the same block like three times or whatever. Just like, at least it takes it slow on you. Also, I kind of love how b how bassy the the sound is for the thing on spring. Ah, oh, no, it anticipated my movement. God damn it! I don't know which square. Oh, okay, it's down here. Yeah, it's a Pac-Man that functions. So hey, it all. Find the hidden trace from the left top to the right button, oh yeah. Alright, we have to figure out how to get to the bottom right with the pet that we have going here. Alright, is this the pet? Yay! You made it! First, there will be squares, and then there will be an actual pet. Ah, uh, so it is just taking exact Qbert level progression. Yep. Oh boy. But hey, at least is we that... had some levels uh, without the aggression. So I and guess it's kind of old. chasing me too. Oh yeah. Also, now we have this thing that also undoes all of your progress. With that said, however, yep. you can choose in the game option to disable them if you want. Oh, that's nice. So hey, it's a dig bag game, but at least you have ways to advert uh, its dig baggery. So is I take it that level three will add it so that um, as you step on the things repeatedly, it will flip it to it'll go back and forth between. Uh, maybe I have no clue. I don't think I've ever been in level two. Oh no! Fucking stealth child! 
So yeah, that's Jew. So top 10 electron pushers. Okay, so we're supposed to be pushing electrons? Was that the yeah, entire look, purpose? It looks like you were trying to like uh, do something with a circuit board. I don't know. I still. Ah, my God! Oh, God. Get it off! Get it off! <laughs> All right, so that's juice, I guess.